Hi, my name is Linda, and this is my sister Amy. And our dad created David Higginson's Professional Chord System, which allows you to play pretty much any song you want in a matter of minutes. And today we're going to teach you a song by Louis Capaldi called Someone You Loved. So this song is actually pretty easy to play because it only has four chords, with the exception of one extra chord during the bridge. And that was the intro right there. Why right. Don't you teach it to him, Linda. Okay, sounds great. So we're gonna go to the D flat. The first chord is a D flat, and we're gonna go to the D flat two above middle C. Here's middle C. We're gonna skip that one and go up to here. So. We're going to be playing it in what is called the spread position, if you are familiar with David Higginson's professional chord system, which means you play the name of the chord, which is a D flat, or the root of the chord, and rest your middle finger on that. And the pinky will be playing an F, and the thumb will be, be playing an A flat. But you don't play that root note, do you, Linda? Do you, you play the That's left right. hand? Yes, you actually will be playing it down here, and I'll show you that later. So Awesome. Um, so the rhythm that goes with this song is a rocking rhythm. It goes alternates from the F to the A flat, and you play that four times for four counts. One, two, three, four. So that's pretty easy. That's something that you can do. And the next chord is an A flat. So with that chord pattern, the same one, you find the name of the chord, which is an A flat, and rest your middle finger on that. And the notes you play along with that are the C in the pinky and a D flat in the left hand. An E flat, right. An E flat, sorry. <laughs> and you alternate back and forth four times again. And then the next chord is a B flat minor and the notes in that are the B flat in the middle and the pinky plays the D flat and the thumb plays an F. Same rhythm. And the last chord is a G flat and the pinky plays the B flat and the thumb plays the D flat. So, and then that, you throw in that little fun note, right? Oh before. yes, thank you for reminding me. Um, to connect this chord to the, the following chord, we're gonna play a pickup note, which is an A flat. So it goes. Okay, so those are all the chords that we're gonna be learning today. That's it? And yes. that's the whole song? Yes. That sounds awesome. Exactly. So let us add that bass note that was in the right hand, but we're gonna put it down here. So what we're gonna do is hold down the D flat for this first chord, which is a D flat, and we play the first beginning note at the same time, and then continue the rhythm. Two, three, four, A flat. One, two, three, four, B flat minor. Okay, that is the That's introduction. That's the intro. Yeah. And then you only have to play that like, um, you do the same thing for the verse? Yes. And so for the introduction, introduction you play it one time through, mm -hmm. that chord chain. And then all we have to do is bring down the... Pattern. pattern down one octave and that's what's cool about the chord system is once you learn something in one place you can play it everywhere on the piano so the verse starts and we're gonna do the same exact pattern here's the D flat it's actually the D flat right above middle C mm -hmm. That's basically the entire intro and verse. It is. And the only thing you have to get used to is just that rhythm. And you can go slow at first and then you speed it up to the original speed of the song. And this is in the same key of the original, original song. Singer. Yep. Awesome. So um, the only thing that we're going to talk about now is when it gets to the chorus, there is a slight difference in the left hand. We play the right hand exactly the same. D flat, A flat, and so on. And so instead of playing just this D flat, we're gonna go down an octave, which which is just the D flat below. And we play and hold that the same time that we do that. It gives it a more full feeling sound and I think it sounds epic and awesome. It does. It's it's building. The song is building. Awesome. So um let's see. They basically learned it the whole is song. Is that it? Yeah. So <laughs> 
why don't you sing it along with it and let's see how it sounds. Okay, let's go for it. sound then you need to learn to play the way professionals play so thanks for joining us today and subscribe to our YouTube channel we would love that we're just getting started and we'd love you along for the ride and you can also follow us on Instagram and Facebook of course yeah and how about if you're interested in the chord system go to our website and take a look at it and see if it'd be something that you would love yes anyway remember what our dad used to say talent, talent can, can be, be learned. learned bye thanks